Austin City Limits presents our rare hip hop hour with Run the Jewels. Now to the most distinctive and celebrated names in rap, LP and Killer Mike, Run the Jewels. Live like a man, but I'm 
particular event. The other ones were Most Death and Kendrick Lamar. Good company. We are the first rap group to do a rap show in that we only have two MCs and a goddamn DJ. Y'all give it up to DJ Trackstar. Now we'd like to apologize ahead of time. Yes. For any profanity that we may be using. Oh, we're gonna curse like goddamn sailors, kids. Apologies to those editing this for live broadcast whenever that happens. We've been back here so many times and every fucking time I come back to Austin, I'm so happy to be back in Austin because I know that the crowd is gonna give us that energy and you guys always have. And we're so lucky to have you motherfuckers give a shit about what we're doing right now. And I just wanna honestly say thank you for that. Thank you. This means the world to us. And we don't take it lightly. And we're gonna do everything that we can to make this place and this night a motherfucking blockbuster night tonight. So if you feel good, put your hands in the air like this. Let me see it. Hey! Hey! Bunches and bunches, punches is thrown into your front list. Hoodles and noodles, they ain't bullets that suck the noodles. Let's have a voodoo. Prove that we were fucking brutal. Dirty work, do the deed and the dash. I plan to have this 
stuck in our missing gun position. We run a brand with instructions and number one commitment. It's all a joke between my contractions and all the fittings. So we disappear in the smoke like we're fucking magicians. No hope to go, cause these simple suckers been served to know. Let's stop out of morning, my busy offense is fucking soldiers. We might be giants, standing on little dandy shoulders. No pumps and pussy for burial your panty panty holders. I take the shake of hey. DDT on them mausoleum. I'm the fellas, no need for any evaluation. I'm a fellas of Johnson and Jimmy. Spraying faces. Any cop that is sacred will get to face it. Like any time a burden gets replaced. Face it. Face it. Two fellows at the top of that.
Which is not to say that we don't respect you if you cry. It's that we don't want you to cry, because that would be sad. Well, <clears throat> apart from that awkward segue, I feel like this is going pretty well. One of, the, uh, one of the things that the guys at the marketing team came up with, God bless his twisted soul, is that uh, when you guys came into this building, you may not have realized, but you were given not only a ticket, but one golden 36 inch invisible chain to put around your neck. It's like that, but invisible. And the reason why we gave you this is so that you can walk away feeling the way that we feel when we're together and we're having fun and we feel empowered. We want you to be able to walk away knowing that you have this around you. Not everyone can see it. Only people in this room can see it. And you know, when you look at each other, you can do this if you see each other. That way you'll know. There's all sorts of you. You're working everywhere. We've infiltrated everywhere. But you just remember that that shit is around your neck next time somebody tells you that this fucking world is not gonna be exactly what you want this fucking world to be. You remember that that chain is around your neck. Every time someone tells you that you're not gonna do what you wanna do in your fucking life because of their mistakes. Anytime anybody tells you that this world has somehow been irreparably lost to the dirty, filthy minds of old, warmongering motherfuckers. Anyone, any, anytime anyone says anything like that, you can look them straight in the eyes and you could say, fuck you, I have an invisible 36 inch chain around my neck. I can keep going. 
I love the Run the Jewels audiences because they're all about audience participation. You feel what I'm saying? That means that means the other MC in the group is you. So when I say one, two, three, I'm gonna say one, two, three. I'm gonna say one, I'm gonna say two, and I'm gonna say three. I want y'all to scream to the top of y'all lungs. Hey, Dad, Uncle L, stay cold. One, two, three, 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 three. Good. Definitely good. No. That was like TV taping good. That wasn't Run the Jewel Show good. We're gonna give it one more we're shot. Gonna, that's right, we're gonna say this shit like we made this shit. We're gonna say this shit like this is WWE. Hold one, hold two, hold three, hold three, 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 three,
love y'all, man. You guys are amazing. And sir and, and ma'am, can I just say, and this is, I don't want to point you out, but you two right there, I hope that you've been married for many years. But I gotta say, I was watching you guys from backstage on the monitor. You guys got here a little bit earlier than a lot of other people were. You sat right there, and I was watching you from backstage, and I was like, man, I hope they like us. I hope they have fun tonight. So, and it looks like you are, so I just you want to say. You guys are jamming your ass off. Thank you very much. It just warms my heart. I appreciate it. I definitely know those people smoked marijuana together before. <laughs> so many of these and never thought we'd be on this stage, man. So thanks for public, thanks for public broadcasting, one. Because I don't care what they say about watching TV makes you dumber, I am definitely smarter because of PBS, man. And, you know, it actually, I remember earlier today, it moved you so much that you wrote what I thought was, frankly, a pretty soul-stirring poem about the event. And uh, I don't know if you'd be so brave as to share the sort of more tender side of what you do with I this feel amazing crowd right here, but I'd love to encourage you, maybe with a round of applause from the people in front of us, to, to just let Mike break out of his show and give you guys Michael Render for once and not just Killer Mike, you know? And it goes a little something like this. I'm a writer and provider and I don't tolerate Oh shit! I must be out on them seeds, meaning I obliterate Oh shit! Well, every time I try to like a rapper, they turn into Oh shit! Make me ski masks on they uh-uh and Run and juice and motion! Run and juice fast! Run and run and juice fast! Run and 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 Just keep that in my truck, truck. How you like my style, bro? Ain't nobody smiling, bro. bro. 
like to greet the preacher with a grin and a gut. Come on! dedicated to anybody in your life that uh, may have left you too fucking early, that may have left this planet too young. Um, 
And if you could close your eyes and you could think about them here, then you know what this song is like. <laughs> quite successfully pulled off yet. You guys are our guinea pigs. We can always edit it out. How long before the hate that we hold leads us to another holocaust? So we don't need in it and we can't get it. Stop, we can't ever haul it off. It's too clear, nuclear is too near and the whole is the water talk. Say the revolution right here, right now, and they ain't calling off. I'ma be a torn knight in this war time. Check your wrist. Ready, kids? Off a tree, a right shot of light. Got a baby ready for the light. I just wanna live. I don't wanna ever have to load a clip. Only hard bliss. I ain't still a kid in my heart, but these motherfuckers sick. They don't give a shit. Not at all. They don't even want to let you put your little piss in a pot. They don't want your love. Shit is bought. Motherfuckers steady getting rich for the love. Love when you back. Trust him to the blood of 
kicks you in the butt. I mean, firmly square-toed in the ass. And you say to yourself, I don't want to be here anymore. And I want to let you know that when you feel down and you feel unloved and you feel unthought about and uncared for, if you look around you in this room, this is a community of people who have the same thoughts and ideals as you, even though you're very different. I'm sure you guys like love and peace and harmony and fairness and equality and care. So I want you to remember in your darkest times that there is somebody who gives a shit about you. And I want all of those who feel great to make sure that we reach out to those that may be alone or lonely or that we love. For the holidays, take your ass to the Veterans Administration Hospital and help someone who might not have family. But make sure that you don't allow people to stay down. And if you feel down, I want to let you know that ending your life ain't the answer. Tomorrow brings answers and a better day. I'm Killer Mike. This is LP. This is called Down.
we don't see any disparate, you know, sort of, you know, uh, divide between us being the, the, you know, the friends who like to hang out and kick it and joke and, 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 and aren't taking everything so seriously and saying something that really means something to you. And I think that maybe if you get that right, then you can really <coughs> feel it on the other end, you know? We're not here making a, a you know, a, a political statement as much as we're making a human statement. We made this record during a period of time in which the world really was tumultuous and it was affecting us. And you can hear it in the music. And there are periods throughout this record where you can almost tell like, oh, the, it was hitting the fan pretty hard right. in this time. And then we come out of it and, 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 and it's back to fun again. So that's the way our life has been. We've reached you know, a crux in this, in this nation and in the, globally where we can all let fear and individualism and selfishness keep us in our individual houses, in our individual states and nations, and not recognizing ourselves as a part of a bigger humanity. And that's only going to lead to more war, pestilence, and violence. Or we can challenge the different oligarchies that rule this globe, whether it's communism, capitalism, whether it's dictatorship or free republics, whatever you choose to call it, what I know is everywhere we travel in the world, nationhood seems to stand above humanity, and that's upside down. And we try our best to remind people through our music that recognizing other people's humanity and love and compassion essentially are going to be the way. And sometimes that takes punching you in the face <laughs> to make you realize that, and we're not afraid to say that part too. But you know, ultimately what, what, what we want to do is less than a political agenda, but push the social agenda of you know, loving your fellow human being. Tune in to Peabody award-winning Austin City Limits to experience the best in original music. To view full ACL episodes, go to pbs.org. Run into 